Now let's create a complex engraving cut. I wrote some text and I use a fancier font to put a letter N in here in a real fancy font and now we'll create an engraving cut. Let's go to uh, toolpath, contour toolpath again specify the name because I deleted the previous one check mark. Now in this case I'm not going to touch each letter so instead of using chain let me move the window a little closer I will use a window option. We'll click on a window and create a window around the entire set of letters as many lines as we need and then after the window is done you touch any one of the letters in a shape and it'll select it. In other words instead of using our uh, traditional chain we'll use a window this time and the check mark. Great. Now I'm going to select one of the center tools. You can choose engraving tools of any choice but I needed something with a sharp corner on the bottom so I'll use a small number one center drill to cut this engraving. Great we'll choose contour parameters we'll turn it off so it'll go by the center line again and the depth will be minus 0.02 20 thousandths great we'll touch the check mark and as you can see the toolpath is created I'm going to orient the part a little bit on the angle like that and let's uh, execute click on play and as you can see the entire contour of the letters is produced it takes a few seconds but you'll be able to see it very clearly great at this point we can rotate the part and we can zoom a little into it you can see that it's cutting 20 thousands deep and if you zoom in even zoom in even further you could kind of see the angular cut of the tool wonderful try this on your own